What's up guys, it's Bean here and welcome back to another video. Sorry I've been really inconsistent with the uploads lately. Uh, I've just been kind of busy and I don't know, like I just was a little demotivated for a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. Just haven't really felt like making that many videos, but I wanna try to get back into it. Uh, I'm not feeling like demotivated anymore. And uh, yeah, so anyways, uh, today we're gonna do a kind of simple install video. Um, as you guys heard me talk about in my last bike vlog, I'm gonna be getting rid of these handlebars. Uh, so if any of you guys want them, uh, you can have them. I know some of you guys prefer lower rise handlebars. I wanted to try it out just to be different, but I'm not a fan of it. But if you guys are interested, I'm just going to sell them for like 20 bucks. Um, the only bit of damage is underneath here somewhere. Right there is a little bit of damage you can kind of see. Uh, I dropped it uh, when I was holding it next to my dirt bike. And it fell right onto the foot peg and just scraped it up. So kind of unfortunate because these were in perfect condition for a while. <laughs> But, you know, stuff happens, accidents happen, so they're not bent or anything, they're totally fine. It's just, you know, a little scratch there, but no big deal. If you guys are interested, uh, DM me on Instagram, xbeanyt, and I'm just going to sell them for 20 bucks. They're 10 millimeter rise, race face chesters, so. So, anyway, over here, I have the new handlebars. Uh, these are also race face chesters, basically the exact same thing, except you might be able to tell these rise quite a bit higher, so. Uh, I can't wait to get these on and see how it feels. See if it uh, fixes my somewhat minor back aches while I'm riding uh, because I didn't like how hunched over I was when I ride. So let's do that. Now this install is gonna be pretty simple. I'm just gonna need a multi-tool here that has Allen keys. I think I took it out already. Let's see where I put it. Aha, uh -huh. I did take it out already. Here it is. So this install is gonna be pretty simple. Just gotta take out these bolts here and then take everything off of the handlebars and then once I do that, I can slide the new handlebars in right here, tighten this down, and then put everything else back on. Pretty simple, so let's get to it. annoying because I've pretty much gotten everything but I can't figure out how to do this one. I took off the little bolt here that clamps it onto the bar but it just won't come off. I'm thinking that there's something else I need to unscrew. I mean now it's kind of sliding. It's actually oh, okay I mean I guess that works too. <laughs> it just decides to slide off like when it wouldn't earlier. <laughs> All right well now we got nothing on these bars. I'm just gonna take off these four little little Allen, uh, Allen bolts here and then we'll have no bars and then we'll throw the new ones on that are sitting right there. Looks pretty funky with no handlebars, doesn't it? <laughs> and then all these hanging down here, the brakes and shifter and dropper and whatnot. <laughs> all right, let's throw these new bars on. Alright, the bars are on, now I just gotta get the rest of the stuff on it. I already think I'm gonna like this more, plus I like how it looks more, which is already a good start. Now the only thing is, I can't get this to sit totally flush. You may notice the right side looks a little tighter than the left side, and I don't know exactly why that is. And I checked, the bolt lengths are the same, and I tried switching them out from the bottom and the top, but still not completely even, but I don't know, I think it's fine as long as it's totally tight, it's not really gonna go anywhere, so I'm not really too worried about that. Uh, just kinda like an OCD thing, maybe I'll take a look at it another time. But now I'm just gonna throw the rest of the stuff on. Okay guys, uh, everything's pretty much on except the shifter. Unfortunately, I messed up while doing that. I forgot I'm supposed to put the shifter on first. And I figured there's no point of recording me 
um, taking all this off and then putting this on and then putting all that back on. But so you guys get the idea. Um, I really like how it looks so far, actually. Um, I'm gonna have to sit on it real quick. Here, let's try that. Let's put my dropper seat down. But uh, I don't know. I kind of like how this feels. I, I think it was a good change. Um, I'm pretty excited to see how it feels while riding. So I'll have to try that soon. Um, but yeah, guys, so do expect regular uploads to come back. I know I've kind of been slacking lately. Unfortunately, my YouTube videos aren't monetized right now because I left my old network and I'm going through YouTube AdSense. And since YouTube put that new monetization thing into place where you have to have like a thousand subscribers and 4,000 hours watched or something, um, I do meet those like requirements by, you know, quite a bit. So I'm not really worried about that. But since they're not, that, uh, since that new system's in place, um, it is taking a while to get approved for YouTube AdSense. So, so I'm just kind of waiting to get approved on that. Then I'll start making money again from these videos, so. But as I'm sure most of you know, I don't do YouTube for the money. Um, I did actually just pay off this bike, so I don't really need that money like crazy anymore. I'll probably make a video about me paying off that bike soon because this bike was almost paid for completely by me, uh, excluding selling my old bike, which my parents bought for me. So I'm gonna make a video on that soon. Uh, just kind of go into further detail on how that works. And also guys, um, I'm thinking to start a new series on the channel related to that right there. So uh, I might start that up soon. Not sure when, um, kind of whenever I feel like the time's right. But yeah, uh, I really like these bars, so that's cool. I'll do the shifter off camera because I'm just wasting your time if I show you guys that. But expect regular uploads soon, guys. Um, probably starting now, I'm gonna try to be posting every, at least once a week again, sometimes twice, kinda depends on uh, what's going on. Oh, and also I'm selling these for 20 bucks, so make sure to DM me on Instagram if you want it. 10 millimeter rice. Hopefully I'll get out and ride again soon too. Unfortunately, it's gonna rain this weekend, so I don't know if I'll be able to ride, but if I am, uh, I'll make a video on it. And I'll probably just do a street ride because I know you guys like to see that. Thanks for watching everyone. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. Regular content's coming back, I promise. I'm not gonna slack anymore. Uh, I honestly don't like slacking, so I wanna be posting more often for you guys. See you guys in the next video. Peace.